tech widget here back with another video and i just figured out how you can get 60 fps on an iphone like i'm not even clickbaiting right now it's i have an iphone 7 plus matte black 128 gigabytes and i can get 60 fps so before this glitch it has 20 or 30 fps right so that proves that i don't have a 60 fps option and then what you want to do is you want to close out your fortnite and all your other tabs just close out all your tabs and open up fortnite again and once it says connecting go to your control center i mean no notification center 10 times i'll show you what i mean one two three four five six seven eight nine ten so and then you just wait and you spam the finish finishing button and don't worry guys it's probably not gonna work on your first couple tries because mine's probably gonna work on my third or fourth try i might even get lucky on my first try but it will take you a couple tries to do but once you get used to it it will take you only like three or four but it's it's really 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 cool like you can only play like one or two games with this like only for 30 minutes then your phone overheats so you don't want to fry your battery or anything so you only want to play for up to 30 minutes and then turn off your phone give it a break for like an hour and then get back on and start grinding so as we can see as it's logging in let's wait for it guys a good sign is that it takes a very long time to load in so as you can see it's taking a very very long time for me to load in and it's going to take me a couple tries to do this i don't think i'll get it this time but it will be awesome if i do in one take that would be very very nice but i don't think i will so guys don't get fooled by this so um some other youtubers are turning off their phones that was patched so if you see an old video like that that's not gonna work that's patched i try ever i tried everything last night and this is what worked so this is what i'm trying to show you guys and it worked for me and it's gonna work for you okay it didn't work that time as you can see it's still 30 fps so let's try that again it takes multiple tries to do this, so as you can see, I'm gonna load up Fortnite again. It takes multiple tries to do this, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten times, you do it ten times, and then you just keep on spamming it. I'm just gonna fast forward this because y'all don't want to see. As you can see guys, we are loading in with a loading, brand new loading screen. So it's gonna take me a couple tries. This is my second try. And as you can see, we got it on my second try guys. Right there and let's go to settings really quick. As you can see, it's still 30 and 20. And look how good it looked much. I'm gonna hop into a solos match to show you how good it performs. It is a game changer. Okay, guys, as we are loading into the game, look how smooth. he claps people and he clapped me but anyways guys that's how you get 60 fps on a dang iphone 7 plus 128 gigabytes guys look how smooth this gameplay is and i had some tearing i had some low fps but that's um because that's i've been on my phone all day if you start at the beginning of the day i promise you it's going to be at 60 fps mostly the whole game but thank you for watching and i'll see you next time peace out